A potential zoning change is causing Bay County residents to speak up. If passed, the change would allow an empty lot in the neighborhood to be used for commercial use instead of residential use. News 13's Anna Hoffman tells us more about what this proposal actually means and how the residents plan to fight it. At the start of May, county planners received an application regarding a property on Bayshore Drive. Came in requesting to change approximately 1.3 acres from residential to commercial. Um, the, applica the application indicated they anticipate some sort of uh, boat storage. After reviewing the request, Smith says officials notified residents of the area about the project by mail, newspaper, and this sign. Right now it's a high level just land use change. Once they come with a specific development proposal, we look at the site plans and we'll be able to make sure and try as best we could to minimize impacts. Residents on Bayshore Drive spent large amounts of time and money to have their dream homes. Once they heard the news that their peaceful neighborhood could soon become more commercial, they were not happy. We worked on a very big petition this weekend. We've got everybody's doors in our whole neighborhood of about 275 homes. Residents are planning to attend Tuesday's hearing to voice their opinions about this rezoning. They worried traffic could increase in their neighborhood and their property value could be affected. We've got million dollar homes around this piece of property here. And for instance, if they want to put a big, huge boat barn here, that would be about the ugliest thing that you could do in a residential neighborhood. Another resident, William Fuller, just finished building his dream home and never anticipated a business setting up next door. I'm not real happy about it because we can't get a definitive answer from anybody about what they want to do with the property. If the Planning Commission approves it, it will then head to the Bay County Board of Commissions for a vote. In Panama City Beach, Anna Hoffman, News 13, Panhandle Strong.